Hello. In this short movie, I'm going to show you some Eggbomb guitars. To start with, you see the sign that was on the outside of the factory in Best. It says in Dutch, Muziekinstrumentenfabriek Eggbomb. More information can be found at my website www.egmontguitars.nl You also see here the book I've written. In January 2010 the book will be there in an English version. To start with I'm going to walk you through my room where you can see some Eggmans hanging, or Lions, or Wilson guitars, all made by the Eggman brothers here in Holland. You'll see a lot of them. Here is an electric Hawaiian guitar from the early 50s, a nice white under it, a so-called Gibson model electric Hawaiian. This one's in brown sunburst. This is one of the first electrics Eggman made. Then you'll see a Cram Wilson, a sunburst Wilson, all from the 50s, another Sunburst Wilson with a cutaway. This one is a Caledonia, also made by Egmont, also from the 50s. A black Egmont, the type was called Caledonia. And here is a very nice Eggman 1955 Type ES57. It's a nice one. Then there is a Lion Violin Model 6 string and also a Lion Violin, but then for the bass player. Another LD is this Rambler 2 with a very very nice headstock as you see. Behind it a Rossetti Bass 7 with a Royal Pick Guard. We go down and you'll see a white solid 7 with the black royal PU. Then it looks like Vox, but it's Eggman Lion and a very, very strange one. Watch this body of this Rambler. Yes, it looks like marble. It's a very heavy guitar, but plays perfectly. Before it, an Eggman Electra. Then some acoustics. The JG60 here. This is an Eggman Alpha. A Miller. Yes. From the 50s. A very early and 40s acoustic and the one George Harrison started with and for cowboy lovers or western lovers you could buy in the early 50s this Lone Ranger and also an Egmont Amp Close to it, 
one of the rarest Ekmans to see and to find is this two neck guitar, well guitar, one six string and one mandolin part. Some small work here. Even they were made in Holland. Whoops, my granddaughters and their artwork. You'll see a small royal lamp. And Eggman called this the Space Master. And some other small parts. And artists who used an Eggman. Well, that's what I wanted to show you. Hope you liked it.